Okay, let me see one. Keep it short. Short backswing. I don't care how well you hit it. I want to see that short backswing. Much better. If it goes too hard, you shorten it even more. Getting better. So keep shortening it and, and smooth out the forward motion so it's not quite, and it's really stay on that left side. Okay, Ed, you're going to look at your putting stroke. Um, on the left is your stroke before we begin uh, talking about some of the fundamentals. Then on the right is, is the second round where I had you putt uh, while focusing on some of the uh, fundamentals that we had talked about. First, let me look at your setup. It's very good. You have a good stance. Uh, you're, you're tilted over. I like your posture. I like your arm position. You have your elbows in your and tucked into your sides. That's pretty standard on tour. So that's a very good setup. Uh, so let's. I'm going to take your putter back now and take a look at your your backswing. And before I do that, though, I want to look at your arms and shaft. It's almost like the letter Y here. And so uh, we're going to kind of check those angles out in the during the backswing. So as you start back, go to about right there, and the thing I like is that you have maintained that letter Y. You haven't gotten wristy, so you've held that and just swinging your, your shoulders. So that looks really good. That's a nice, nice stroke right there. Now we're going to go forward through the ball and just as you hit it you have your your eyes down looking but as even almost immediately as the ball comes off the face of the club your eyes continue to follow that ball And what we want, and what we talked about, is to try to not turn to look at the ball until your stroke came to a complete stop. That you want to hold your posture and your putter follow-through position, and then after that comes to a stop, then you can turn and look. So let's look at that. That's what we worked on. Um, and so we're going to take a look at that as you go back. Starting forward now, you're just now hitting the ball, eyes are down, eyes are still down, eyes are still down, eyes are still down, eyes are still down. Now you've come to a complete stop and your eyes are still looking down and it's only until now you can start to turn and look. That was perfectly done. That's, that's a very good stroke. So as you go forward, you're going to want to practice that uh, and make it part of your natural stroke. Now we're going to look at your chipping stroke. On the left is before uh, we began working on some of the fundamentals. So let's take a look at that. And on the right, by the way, is uh, after we worked on your fundamentals. On your setup, you uh, have a little, you're kind of evenly balanced between the feet. I know they're on a the, little bit of a hill here, so that's kind of, kind of throwing the angle of the camera off a little bit. But you, um, and you do have your hands in front of the golf ball and have that shaft lean. That's good. I do wish you would have a little more weight on that left side to uh, promote a clean hit on the golf ball more consistently. Let's take a look at your uh, backswing here and I want to point out I'm going to put um, a little rectangle right where your knee is, your left knee, and let's kind of, in fact we'll do both knees here, I want to kind of watch 
as you go back you can see how uh, this left knee particularly um, moved toward the, the back foot so you have swayed your weight to the right to the right foot in your backswing I like the fact that you have a nice extended left arm here and a little hinge here in your wrist that's that's good for this shot um, but I would prefer you have keep your weight on your left foot start with a little bit more weight on your left foot and then keep it there in your backswing it's very important in these short shots okay now we're going to take it through the ball So as you hit it, got under the ball really well. Pretty good technique there other uh, on the impact and through the ball. Now let's look at your chip shot on the right. This was after we had talked about some of the important fundamentals of chipping. Uh, feet close together, weight on your left side, choking down on the club, hands forward. All those are really good and, and uh, let me, I'm going to take this one back to the starting position. And one of the things that uh, we can kind of see is that you do have a little bit more um, weight. If we drew a line from this knee down and from this knee down, you, you're setting up with just a little bit more leg angle towards the, the target. Uh, which is good. So I like that a lot. Now we're going to, I'm going to do the same thing with that box on your right knee. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, I'm going to put it right there. And now let's look at your back swing. And you'll see that that, that knee does not move. You're keeping really stable on that left side. You didn't sway to the right one bit. So that's really good. The other very important fundamental, and you do an excellent job of it, is what we call holding that flying wedge. What I mean by that is that th this, this angle right here, shaft and arm or back of that right hand you have kept it you didn't throw that away so that's very good 